Hello everyone, welcome to Technical Voice. In the last video, we have created the SQL database on Azure portal. Now in this video, we will update this database or insert some rows into the uh, employees table through our pipeline. So in day to day uh, development, whenever you are going to give new deployment, you need to update the database. OK, so for this, you can uh, if you have uh, your deployment is automated, then you need to also automate the uh, updation of your database. So let me flip to our release and edit. and uh, i have currently one job which is a test environment uh, i have deleted the broad environment because we don't need any more so let me add it and create a new task and search for sql database uh, azure sql database student. let me add it so let me add here because uh, before the deployment of our app we want to update our database so let's select the Azure subscription, uh, Azure SQL Server, uh, and what is it? It let me go to my overview, and let me refresh it. So this is our server name database name is technical voice and technical voice user and our password is SSI and here you need to select the deploy type if you have any uh, file then you can select the file for example SQL script file and you need to give the path here so where is your file okay and uh, for now, uh, I'm going to select the inline SQL script, uh, but usually we just select the you know the file and update in our uh, repos and give the path of the the path uh, the path of the our file. So let me select some inline script. I am inserting two rows into the employee table, and uh, that's it. So let me save it. So it's done. Let me go to my pipeline and create a release for our test environment. Hit on create. Go to the release 10. So before deploy, uh, let me show you that I don't have any, you know, uh, records in the employee table. Query editor. Mm. Okay. And let me go to the tables and select top rows so you can see I don't have any rows okay so let me deploy it deploy it. so currently it's being queued and once it's uh, completed it will deploy our application our web application as well as uh, update the database Okay, <coughs> it's done. So let's see and verify that it has created the new rows. Yes, you can see that uh, the two rows are inserted into the employee table. So that's how you can update your database uh, through the pipeline. Thanks for watching this. Bye bye.